This guy is going to find a lump of coal in his Christmas stocking. He broke into UNM Center for Disabled Students and stole from them. News 13's Rebecca Atkins is live at UNM with a look at the thief and what they took, what he took. Rebecca. Well, Jessica, he broke in over the weekend. Police thought they had him, but he got away. They're hoping this surveillance video does him in. For disabled students at UNM, this building is a huge help. But early Saturday morning, a thief was busy helping himself to monitors used by visually impaired students. It's, it's horrible. Staff at the university's Accessibility Resource Center are shocked. Whatever a student needs, to be granted equal access to education, we provide that to them. Christner says they help disabled students with tasks like taking tests. They have cameras everywhere. That are recording uh, all sessions. And because of those cameras, this thief couldn't hide as he ran from room to room, cigarette in mouth. He thought he'd be clever and steal, you know, the camera over there, but I have three other cameras that were recording him. He came in through this window, and this is the first item he took. He then tried to be sneaky, looking both ways, but when he got to the end of the hall, the room he broke into locked behind him and set off an alarm. But he escaped through the emergency exit. Helped himself to some of the aids that we use for uh, visually uh, impaired students. He also destroyed this camera, but that's not the main concern. Not only is that... Uh, uh, impacting, you know, a set of our students that uh, really need the most help. But because of a budget crunch, we will not be able to replace that equipment as well. So they put his picture everywhere, even on the window he snuck in through, in hopes he'll never come back again. You harm, you know, the weakest part of our uh, society, we're going to get your picture out there. Now, the manager at the center tells me that unless the thief takes these monitors to another school, he won't be making any money off of them. The staff at the center also thinks he may be responsible for another break in they had just a few weeks ago. Jessica, back to you. All right, thank you, Rebecca. UNM police thought they had the thief Saturday morning on campus, but he got away while they were trying to handcuff him. They have no idea who he is.